What's up YouTube? It's First Shift here and today I am going to show you how to get um, I guess what you would call a panoramic wallpaper. Um, as you see here I have a picture that I had downloaded and put on in a you know folder named it wallpaper and put it on my uh, iPod as you see right there and uh, you know usually you get these pictures and you have to cram them down into a 320 by 480 set there to get it to fit on the iPhone or iPod touch but today I'm going to show you how to do something a little bit different but it's uh, super awesome to show you what it is let me just go ahead and do it and then I'll show you how and uh, once you see this it's super simple it's really not hard at all um, for what it does and how easy it is to do it's really cool you know, every theme I've ever been across, any paid theme, regular theme, they're always 320 by 480. Came across this, um, you know, I was messing around with some other stuff and I figured out how to do this. I don't know. It just seemed really simple. So, as you see here is the same picture. But, when I slide over, the picture is a panoramic view that covers three pages. So, it's not crammed into the 320 by 480. It's actually a panoramic view of the wallpaper for three pages. As you see right there. So it really clarifies the picture, makes it look super cool. And uh, I'll show you how to get this because it's really not hard at all. And it's uh, sweet actually, it's pretty cool. You don't have to deal with uh, one page all crammed into one, so you can have whatever how many pages with one picture that just a panoramic view all the way across so to get this I'd want you to go to your computer and I'd want you to make a folder right click go down to get to a new and new folder name it what you like as you said see I made one called first walls now inside this there's gonna be two pictures only concentrate on one and that's the one you'll need to name it so in here you'll put capital P A G E zero page zero. Now this is going to be your wallpaper. So you could add this to any theme, or if you're building a theme, you know you'd have your icons, your UI images, whatever in here. But page zero will be your wallpaper. So don't list nothing or type into it wallpaper. It's page zero. Now the reason I got two, I'll show you why. As everybody knows. 320 by 480 is one page of the wallpaper so it does one page of it now if you take the 320 and you add one which is 640 now you got two pages so it's 640 by 480 so the the size this way stays the same but you're changing this for two two pages so there's one page and two page so you can make this two pages and then finally you got if you add 320 one more time, you got 960 by 480. So if you change an image for your wallpaper and label it page zero, capital P-A-G-E zero, and at 960 by 480, you'll have one picture that's a panoramic view of three pages. So instead of cramming it in one page and your icons just move over that one page, you can have it like this where it's three pages. Now you could probably go higher. I haven't done it because I only got three pages so that's all I did. But uh, this is showing you how to get a panoramic wallpaper on your iPhone or iPod Touch. And uh, again, after you made a theme that you like, all well, your icons or UI images or whatever you have, all you do is go ahead and uh, SSH into your iPhone or iPod Touch and uh, var stash and themes and you would just drag and drop this into your themes check it in your themes as i'll show you i did if i go to my winter board first walls so that's all it is so you could add any other images to it but this is just showing you how to get a panoramic wallpaper for your iphone or ipod touch it looks super cool I hope this video helps you guys. Uh, please rate, comment, and subscribe. You guys are the guys that keep me going and doing all this. So uh, please rate, comment, and subscribe. Uh, you can follow me on Facebook. 
I do have a ping account now, so if you guys uh, want to get a hold of me on that, either email me on uh, YouTube or Facebook, and I'll give you my username. But this is, uh, again, first shift, and uh, I hope this video helps. Can't wait to see what you guys come up with.